Hello everyone, this is Daria from Kaya Academy and welcome to my channel, welcome to this video. Uh, as you can see from the title, what we're gonna to do today is how to shorten YouTube video links. So before getting to that video, before the steps that I show you how, so let's talk about this. Why would you need those YouTube video links? Like many people have uh, problems sharing links like most of the time they do have for example uh when they want to spread the profile of the channel or like how can i say you do not have the chance to keep in mind that long address given to you by the site which i mean uh when you click you know there's this long thing right so uh it will cause your visitors to not being able to remember it again or something right so this is also called causes a bad appearance however youtube allows users to set url addresses themselves and in addition to this it is almost impossible to add an extra note because the link is very long especially when you want to share that uh, thing in for example, you want to tweet it or something, it's going to be too long and since there is character limit, you actually can't do it. So most of the time I face with this problem is, for I actually faced because I didn't know how to use this properly and I didn't know those additions that I actually could do, such as I could choose where, like, for example, I'm going to... Uh, share a video where a tech guy is called doing things right so what i do is but you know the three four minutes he's talking about the previous videos or something like that so uh, what i also learned is also i can choose where to start the video like when i share that link the video automatically will start from that point like from the second a minute 45 second you know some things like that so when you're tweeting it can be a problem or when you're sharing you know I don't know if you have ever received those text messages that's coming from your um, I'm not gonna say grandma because I even received those things from my father he's sending me a text message and the link is like like two pages like and when you link when you click that link, all you're seeing is like, oh, happy birthday card picture or a beautiful view. Like, yeah, thanks, dad. Thanks for sending me those beautiful messages. But I really didn't need that long, very, very long link, you know, because it is even making you feel like you don't want to press on it, right? You don't want to click on it because you'll be like, this this thing even could be a virus or something like it is so long but thanks to youtube nowadays uh even let's assume let's go to this one as you can see these days it's not that hard like it's not like the way it used to be those long ones so even sharing this i'll show you how to set all of them so keep tuned so if you don't want to be that father that is sending those like I wish I would have a screenshot and being a I would be able to show you but let me check if I can find it but most of the time those texts I don't even remember opening them like that you know yes of course I text with my dad most of the time rather than talking but let me no I exact I I deleted them yes I cannot have them on my messages the, those are too long so if you don't want to be that friend who's sending those annoying links that are two pages three pages long and all you want to do is only share the video like just I want my friends to enjoy this video the way I did if that's what you want to do let's go and let me show you how to do it so for example I'd like to send this video right uh, what we're gonna like we will overcome this problem of those long links and by using this shortened link feature of YouTube 
which actually they even use in here right now. What we're gonna do is, of course, let's go, let's start from the beginning. You're gonna go to YouTube. You you don't have to, uh, like this can be done just by visiting youtube.com in your web browser. And all you got to do is select a video or using the top search bar or just find something from here. You don't have to sign in. A, if you don't want to share something that you put on your watch later list or something in that you po liked or you put in your playlist, unless it is something like that, you don't actually need to sign in. And if you want to sign in because this is the issue, that's the way you're going to share it from your playlist or your history or something, uh, there will be a blue button at this corner, at the top right corner. You're going to click on that, put your Gmail email address and password, and you're going to be able to, you're just going to be fine. So, okay, what I'm going to do is I'm just going to click, yes, I'm going to go with this one. And from here, you see the share button, right? We're going to click the share button, and doing so, what will happen, a prompt box will appear as you can see right here and what we're gonna do here we have options right I don't know if you can read them I'm pretty sure you can so what we're gonna do is we're gonna if you want to we we're, we can set you know you see you see the starter right uh, of course we can you see we're gonna be sharing this today but you can also share it in Facebook, Twitter, Blogger, Reddit, Tumblr, or these two that I cannot read, High Five, Pinterest, LinkedIn, or email. But today we're gonna go with the links, so what we're gonna do, for example, I want to start this video to start because also some YouTube channels, they have their intros, not only that they're talking, but there are some videos from um, edits that have been done from their all previous ones. So which minute did you start it? I'm just putting something out of like randomly right now it's 29 minutes so let's put it 5 35 okay you see now yeah, there is some additions to that do you know why so I don't know I actually explained it in a video before but do you see this? Uh, you see this question mark, right? Question mark and T actually, no, question mark is like you're giving it a command. I kind of forgot that part. But you know, this T and equal, uh, it means like time. Oh, yeah, the link is going to start. The question mark is that's what it means. It's going to start at that point, which is 335. You know what's 335? This is the second when you think of 5 minutes and 35 seconds. This is what you get. If you put and click here, you see it became 337. So now what we're going to do here, of course you don't have to do this. You can just do this and it will disappear. And when you do this, it will come back again. What we're going to do is we're going to click copy. And as you can see, can see, link copy to the clipboard. Let's try if it actually copied. Let's click right in your mouse and paste it. As you can see, let's go. Do you see we're in the five, fifth uh, minute and 37 seconds? Yeah, so exactly this is how it works. Of course, you're gonna, you're gonna paste it in a text box or you're gonna send it as an email or a part of a message actually it just stopped in a very good place I don't know if you know Turkish but this is a good tweet so this is pretty much it very easy very simple and of course you can still have some problems and if you face some problems you can let me know in the, on the comments under this video so I can help you out with answering your question as much as I can all of them one by one I will try to answer your questions and if you have suggestions such as maybe it's about my content you want more content you want some t other type of content you can let me know in the comments so when I'm down there trying to answer your questions 
I can actually so I can actually come down there and mm, be answering your questions you know like just I'll, I'll do this mm, while going going I'll be reading your questions I'll be answering your questions and on top of that there will be your suggestions and I'll be reading them and I love I totally love let's go to main page I love feedback I need feedback from you guys so that I can do what I'm doing better if there are points that I'm not doing very good, which I know there is, I know there is, but you guys can help me out with your feedback. So if you like this video and you found it helpful, which what I mean by helpful, as I explain in every video, you came here without knowing how to shorten that URL or how to use it, how to copy it. And now you know, you're leaving this page with knowledge. That means I helped you out. So go like that video and if you haven't subscribed to my channel yet, but I know you did, just reminding if you didn't, go hit that button too and see you guys in the next video.